Joe Biden and Donald Trump engage in a playful yet pointed debate over their golf handicaps. Biden asserts his handicap is impressively low, while Trump questions the truth of his claim. You can see he is six foot five and only two hundred twenty-three pounds or twenty thirty-five pounds. Well, you said six four, two hundred. Well, anyway, that's it. You're anyway. Just take a look at what he says he is, and take a look at what he is. Look, I'd be happy to have a driving contest with him. Kareem, I got my handicap, which when I was vice president, down to a six. Yeah. And well, by the way, I told you before, I'm happy to play golf if you carry your own bag. You can do it. That's the biggest lie. He's a six handicap of all. I was an eight handicap. Yeah. Eight. Yeah. But I have, you know how many? How, I've seen you swing. I know you swing. Let's not act like children. When politicians make grandiose statements, I tend to approach them with doubt. Trump's skepticism about Biden's golf handicap mirrors a broader suspicion about the honesty and integrity of political figures, especially those he opposes. By questioning Biden's claim, Trump insinuates that Biden may not be entirely truthful or straightforward. This critique extends to Biden's leadership abilities, subtly reinforcing the conservative viewpoint that Biden lacks honesty and competence. Golf, as a sport that requires discipline and precision, serves as a metaphor for leadership and skill. Trump's challenge can be seen by the public as a testament to his own leadership strengths, while casting doubt on Biden's capabilities.